turn it off just because it's yeah, it's, it's easier off. for me. But um, we'll go ahead and do straight ahead, uh, clean stall. Okay. So an in route stall. That's going to be two flight idle forward. There's a lot, and we are going just a little smoother on the tr on the decrease there initially. Okay. Maintain heading, maintain altitude. Yep. It's going to take a little while. So, and we can turn to, uh, let's turn to east even. And when I'm doing this, well, I usually put my course there too, just so it's always pointing. The, that's just me. You know what I mean? And when I'm on visual approaches, I always set my course, my CDI once I'm visual, to the runway heading. It's nice and easy reference for situational awareness. I'm going to do a couple just so I don't have to work so hard here. Yep. Hands on the throttle. Airspeed's decaying. Maintaining altitude. Maintaining heavy. So is it going to want to start NTSing on me here? Uh, if you keep those, well, if you brought them any lower, it would, but... They're pretty fine right there. You have to bring them below 100 on a clean, or you'll just be here forever. Okay, you got a little altitude loss. Bring it back. We're down to traffic. This is Comanche 8720, Papa. We are 10 miles to the west southwest, uh, 6,800 descending inbound for landing 21. Oh, yeah. Take this one to a break. Starting to decay very quickly now. Indication. Just the indication. Just the buffet. Oh, there it is. Right Neutral rudder. Eyes. Right rudder. Left rudder. Excuse me. Lift the wing. And power. Positive rate. Get back to heading. She likes to roll around a lot. Oh yeah. What a hussy. She was coordinated too. Just drop that wing. Solo traffic, final four to Papa Zillow is okay. three miles. Gotta come back to 95. We'll cross overhead midfield. Center. We'll just level it yep. 10 because we're going to do the approach eventually. But yeah, you would need to. All right, so bring it on back to about 250. Level at 10. And then we'll set up for a uh, landing stall. And these the rest of these you can recover at the first indication. That would be fantastic. There wasn't a whole lot of buffet before that break, though, huh? Uh, you got the warning horn. And the warning horn, it says activates six to nine knots ahead, right? And that was about right. It was buffet and, and break. wing drop. Yep. Yeah, that thing liked to roll over, man. And it rudder to the floor. Okay. okay, landing configuration. We're going to go yep. flaps half, speed checks. Two Mississippi is going to be a slight pitch up. Still low traffic, skyball 45 kilo, overhead midfield. A lot of pitch up. Centering right downwind, runway three. Yeah, there's so. quite a bit of lift associated with that, that first half of flaps. The yeah. rest. Once you get beyond about three quarters, it is straight drag. 